What's up, YouTube? It's your boy with a new game here called Dead Cruz. And for the description, it says, All I wanted was to take the week off. You book a cheap cruise, but soon you realize you got yourself into a nightmare unlike anything else. Can you find out what happened and escape with your life? So it's gonna get serious. Let's go. I booked this cruise to get away from work, from all those annoying people I see every day. I don't really like people all that much, so why not go on a vacation alone? If I had known what people are really capable of, I would have stayed home. Okay. So I'm on a boat. Cruise ship. Don't need that much class of space for one week. Not hungry. Okay. I know this cruise was supposed to be an escape from my everyday life, but I Assume that we had a destination. As far as I can tell, we were just going in a straight line towards an open sea. What's supposed to be out there? An island? The luxurious resort? Guess we'll find out once we are there. Maybe I should lower my expectations a bit. Being able to go on a cruise for this price is nothing short of a miracle. Would be interested. interesting to know how many people apply for a room to the ship. Maybe I got lucky just as I can hang my jacket. Weird symbol. Okay. And I should probably... Record this symbol. Okay, so... I need it for a puzzle. Sounds like nothing. There's another one here. They're probably nothing, but she don't want to be careful. We have no choice. Alright, I guess that door's not opening. Is that a one one six? See a little light on the corner, but. It's a keypad. was a puzzle. Open, close, open, close, open.
Okay. Well, I got it right the first try. I don't even try. Got two set of keys, picked up some pliers. What's going on here? These keys work for over here. Let me check this out. That's what. Got a little collectible. My therapist said I should write more in my dream diary. So here we go. I don't know what it is about this ship, but it's giving me the chills. Like something horrible happened here before, I keep having nightmares. But unlike the ones I have at home from time to time, these ones come back. It's funny. While we have this instinct to trust people with our lives just because it looks like they know what they're doing. Maybe I am reading too into this, feeling too much. Although I'll, over the years, I have learned to trust my gut. Usually it's right about those kind of things. But we're out on the middle of the Pacific Ocean, went over to go. So we'll just have to endure this cruise for the remainder of this week. And I'm so happy to see my husband again soon, not feel this anxiety anymore. Usually being on a boat does not affect me, but this time it's different. Okay. My beloved Richard, I hope. Your business trip is just as restful as my vacation so far. I know you're not the biggest fan of marine biology, but I am quite pleased with my research so far. I'm excited to share my discoveries with you over a nice cup of tea. Once we're both home again. And thank you again for this beautiful gift. How did you even manage to pay for a cruise like this? I hope you didn't use any of our savings. Anyways, I miss you and I can't wait to see you soon. Okay, so we have a marine biologist. We have blood everywhere in every room. Crowbar for those pieces of wood up there. Smartphone. Pack things for cruise. Tell Mr. Sullivan to set packages while I'm gone. Give Emily the keys and tell her where the cap food is. And we'll, and we'll plans to water. Pray that Emily does not forget anything. Don't put charger in the suitcase. Put it in my backpack for the flight. Balance. Okay. This must be like a little opinion game, but I don't have for that right now. Hey babe, there's no internet in this damn ship. Because why would there be, right? It's not like we live in the 21st century or anything. Anyways, I talked to one of the crew members. They said that we could write a letter and they would send it to you via fax or something. Talking to any of the staff is a bit weird. They are all extremely friendly, but not normal people friendly. More like on drugs friendly. They treat me and the other passengers like gods, not even kidding, it's creeping me out to be honest.
Okay, so... Same thing, blood everywhere. Highly collectible. I don't know whether to wait for a jump scare or to wait for a... The, some kind of monster to come out or the staff, evil staff. To Laura and Alex, hey there, I hope you're not mad at me for just leaving all of a sudden. Your mom and I needed some space, so I decided to go on a little trip all by myself. Not sure everything will be fine and we can go on a vacation together. As a family, just like we do every day. Maybe you and you two and mom can even come on this group with me next year the food here is simply amazing they have everything you love you both love and by that i mean everything you two would have loved it here see you soon okay just got all the rooms i think i need one more okay so is everyone dead uh, to my dear almost publisher, it's Lewis. Do you remember me? I am the guy that wrote that one book that you didn't want to publish. Well, guess what? The book turned out turned into a legendary novel full of surprises, adventures, and great characters. I even went to the extra mile and booked the cruise for some inspiration. Since my main character takes a similar route right before the Mariana Trench, you will know that if you actually read my book. Sincerely, it's going to be best selling author. Looks like signs of struggle here, maybe. Laptop, mails. Dear Mr. Mondell, Mirrorances would like to welcome you to the passenger list of this year's cruise from Tokyo to Papua New Guinea. Our crew is beyond excited to meet you and assist you around the clock for a wellness experience unlike anything else. Regarding your question, this group is not a scam. Due to the majority of our crew being volunteers and the ship itself being private property of our executive manager, we can afford this. We can afford to offer this once in a lifetime experience for a small price of $299. If you have any further questions, please refer to reply to the email. Hello there, I'm very happy I was my boss to approve my pay leave so I can accept your invite. I'm currently writing a novel about a young adventurer like myself. It's a great honor to join a cruise like this. One detail seems a little fiction to me. I looked up other cruises in this region. They all cost like four or five times as much as the one you're offering. I was wondering, is there anything I should know beforehand? It all sounds too good to be true. Hey mom, I'm gonna be a famous author and then you can finally be proud of me. I just spoke to Cruz to get him a mindset of the protagonist of my, of my new novel. And I think this experience will be the last busy possible piece that's my, that's to my success as a writer. I'll be gone for a week, so maybe next Thursday we can meet up and I can tell you all about it. Does that sound good? I'm excited. It's finally happening. So this is an email, chapter 8. He was addicted to the cake. He knew there was something beneath him about 36,000 feet of water. He has saved his salary for the past year to buy a small motorboat. He probably named it the Chuchula. Chulu? Chululu? After learning how to operate it, he packed all his things and booked a flight to Guam, a small island near the Mariana Trench. He was really excited. And then bunch of typing this is hard writing this hard am i even a good writer who the fuck knows right but i can't give up now not after seven chapters i need to feel what david feels he can do it lewis and this is a cruiser here what we offer Lexus cruisers are almost always too expensive for the working class before and are almost exclusively booked by couples we want to offer the exact opposite if you're single don't have much money don't worry our just got your back we have for a high. Oh, sorry about that. Luxurious to one week cruise that anyone can afford. Our dedicated crews working around the clock to give you the holiday experience you deserve. We are excited to welcome you to our cruise ship. All right, so should be all the rooms. 
Okay, I read that already. And then the first one was me. I wonder if what happens if I go back though. Sunset over there. So it's not completely dark. I feel like the sunset adds a little bit to the atmosphere. But yeah, anyway. What had happened to the crew here? There's blood everywhere. Or the people. Like there will be a jump scare, but I won't see it coming. Room one. I guess that's the only one. I'm the only one. Michael Sankari immolated. What does that mean? Everyone else is dead. Can't even crouch, so. Can't really hide, even if I tried. Uh, that door doesn't open. There's something in here I can use. Okay. Even the rug is like a weird design. Hey there, Mom. I finally found a job. I'll be working for six months on a cruise ship. How awesome is that? I'll be making money and travel the world at the same time. I won't be home for half a year, obviously, but my new chef said the work we'll be doing is very important and that there are only a handful of people capable of doing my job. All of this is so exciting. I can't wait to come home and tell you all about it. Love you very much. See you soon. So, hmm. okay. so even the workers are somehow I'm victims of all this. Carrying a stick, but I can't do anything with it, really. Hang on a second. Okay. So let's continue this game. Cat. Is that a guy with a gun? I'm just gonna be careful. I gotta go to the other side.
That's a crew member, probably. Oh, there's a key right there. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this key and run back. I think he's stationary. I don't think he's on the not to this side. Alright, I'll let you do your thing. There's gotta be something in that room. So I did get the key, but not open in any of these doors. Maybe that door? It's a man right here. Go sleep. Or gun. I can't do this anymore. I don't want to do this anymore do this purely to keep something horrible from happening our ancestors knew they had to do it and so do we trust me if there was another way I would nobody would get hurt like this but sometimes the sacrifice is necessary for the greater good I am so sorry for the people on this ship we try our best to make their last days the best they can be so this is a sacrifice sacrifice yourself ending Call for help ending. Well, let me just keep exploring before we end this. I did grab a key. Was it for that room? I believe it was. Let me just check out the end real quick one more time. I told you to keep your keys in your own rooms. Do you want Anyone to get suspicious? I even saw one key later on in the second day. Take care of that immediately. So there's another key somewhere. For that cat door. There it is. else for this door dear mastermind Eric honestly teaching you chess is a bit tiring so I have set up a few exercises for you at least then you don't have to watch I don't have to watch you fail over and over again but hey if you get the if you get it right the surprise cool right all you have to do is tell me which position a knight cannot reach in three moves. Don't be confused. The knight is actually a horse because I know how much of a genius you are. I haven't marked the right piece. Good luck. Idiot. Oh, man. Idiot. What is that? That's like a map of the ocean. Okay. So this one... Okay. 
guess I failed. Can't try again. Let me see. Oh, the door opened. Take like a little altar. Instructions purify the participants. Set up heart. Speak prayer. Sever participant's spine. Open the body. Inspect in organs. Sever participant's head. Offer the body to the sea. Celebrate the participants. Follow the exact order under any circumstances. Make it painless. We don't want to cause more harm than we have to. Yeah, might as well. So this is a sacrifice to Chuchulu or, or whoever that person is. Okay, let me try one more time. I guess it won't let me. Oh, I messed up. I didn't get to see the price. Alright, let's grab the gun and see what I can do with it. The door's closed. Oh, shoot. I'm gonna sacrifice myself. See, I feel like that's a more interesting ending. How many more bullets? Oh well, that was too quick. I don't even get to see it. That's that cruise for you. Hope you enjoy the video. It was a pretty interesting game. I was expecting to see enemies or hide, crouch, but it was none of that. But it was still pretty interesting for what it was thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one peace